There are a ton of great exercises you can choose from. However, the key to improving any specific body part, which I touched on on my last video, is reducing the amount of exercises that you do and focus on getting better at the most important exercises. I'm gonna give you my top three tricep exercises, and then I want you to focus on giving maximum effort for each one of those exercises. Also, slow down the eccentric and control the movement. That's the lowering portion of the lift. I typically recommend a three to four second cadence, then pause at the bottom of the movement for about a second, and then explode the weight back up to the top and focus on squeezing the crap out of each contraction at the top of each and every rep. All right, so here's the thing. At the end of this video, I'm also gonna explain how to set this up if you're a beginning lifter, an intermediate lifter, or an advanced lifter. With that said, let's get into these exercises, man. All right, man, now you know what exercises you need to be doing, but it's up to you to get the exercises done correctly. Again, every single rep of every set you do is important. So don't just go through the motions when you do these. Make sure you put your mind into the movement and really focus on the full rep range of each rep. Okay, if you're a beginner, then I recommend starting out with three sets of each of these exercises. Also aim for 10 to 12 reps of each exercise. That's a total of nine working sets. I want you to do two or three light weight sets first or acclimation sets to get your muscles primed for those working sets. And those are warm-up sets that are not part of the nine total working sets. All right, now if you're an intermediate lifter, then I recommend four sets of each exercise. And I also want you to change up the rep ranges with each exercise. Meaning when you do the heavy compound movement, for instance, with this workout, the parallel bar dips, I want you to shoot for six to eight rep range. So go as heavy as you can. Then 10 to 12 reps on the overhead tricep extensions and then when you do the tricep push down shoot for 15 to 20 reps to really pump a lot of blood into those triceps this is also going to add a different type of stimulus for each of the exercises you're doing all right for the advanced lifters i'm going to recommend four sets as well but i also want you to do this workout two times per week that's going to give you more frequency and volume to really allow you to put a lot of size on those triceps follow this for 12 weeks to allow enough time to focus on some progressive overload meaning just make sure you're bettering yourself from week to week, from workout to workout. Whether it's adding a couple pounds here or there, whether it's adding a rep here or there, just make sure you're doing something to make improvements. This will give your muscles a reason to grow. Also, before you go, man, if you'll please leave me a comment in the comment section below to let me know if you like this type of content. Also, the comments help with the algorithm, so you'd be doing me a huge favor to help me grow my channel. Also, if you please share this video as well, and then save it as part of a play List because what I'm gonna do is create a lot of these different types of workouts for you guys and then I want you to create playlists so that you can put together a full-blown workout program based on whether you're a beginner an intermediate lifter or an advanced lifter got a lot more coming also some 10 minute workout 20 minute workouts a lot of things to look forward to man so hopefully you like this as always get busy get after it and God bless